Pisces, I'm Ellie and welcome to your love reading for the week of July 19th to the 25th. So take note that ito ay isang general love reading. So take what resonates and leave the rest behind. So make sure that you watch you, your sun, moon, rising, and Venus to get a complete picture of your week ahead. So if you're ready, magsimula na tayo. Okay, so... My spirits, angels, and guides, please tell me what is coming towards me. Towards Pisces for the week of July 19th to the 25th regarding love. Please show me the cards. Please show me the cards, the messages clearly. So, nakita nyo naman. Namatay na yung pangila at naubos na. So, kasi kayo talaga yung dulong-dulong sign. <laughs> Next time, Pabalik ta rin ko. Pisces ang unahin ko. Because why not? Right? Overall energy is the the Knight of Swords. Yeah. Someone coming towards you with communication. Or you could be someone communicating. You are getting clear with what you want. Let's see. I don't want to say anything right away. Okay. Wheel of Fortune. So you could see if you hear my dogs barking in the background I am so sorry please bear with me I don't edit or cut my videos okay let me read your spread Okay. Okay. What is coming toward what you don't see coming towards you this week is the six of swords. So you are moving on, moving forward, moving to better things in life. You moving on to better relationships. So yes, this is you moving on. Okay. The overall energy of your spread is the Knight of Swords. Um, you could be dealing with a an air sign. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Or this is you simply understanding what you want and what you don't want. Very communicative, very blunt at this time when it comes to communication. Cutting out the bullshit that you don't need in your life. Very good energy, right? Hmm. There's someone coming towards you. I, I'm getting actually two energies. This can be an ex coming back or someone new coming in. So I'm getting two energies. First is someone new making an offer towards you. And another energy that I'm getting is your ex coming back towards you, offering, offering you love with an apology attached to it. So this is someone who's hurt you in the past, who's going to come towards you with an apology or someone new just coming towards you with you love this is something that you have manifested um yeah you've manifested this very nice i love that you manifest new love i love that you manifest the love that you think you deserve so yes another manifestation card the four of cups mm. i see you being very disappointed at first before you ever manifest the kind of love that you want um, I see that, I'm saying that because you came through and released a lot of burdens in your past relationship. So you released these things, this, the, these disappointments, you released it. And now you are clear with what you want and it's coming towards you. Nice? Yes, it is nice. Um, 
do know that luck is on your side. Fate is turning in, th in your favor. Luck is on your side. Um, you're very lucky at this time. And with that luck, you are sparking, sparking new passion within you. New passion within you. New passion coming towards you. Being offered towards you. So yeah. A very lucky time for love. I see that clearly. Mm. Wow, I am amazed that this is a short reading. My other readings are a, li a little bit longer. <laughs> okay. Overall outcome. Overall outcome is a strength. Could be dealing with a Leo or you have a Leo placement. I'm a Pisces, I have a Leo placement. Well, yeah. Um, seven of Wands and the seven of cups seven and seven so do do understand that when you see synchronicities uh repeating numbers these are angels coming towards you these are these are your angels and guides and then paparamdam sa inyo na hey and dito ako you can ask help from me Ganun lang yun. they're always there but sometimes kasi we tend to do things on our own and they are there na nagpaparamdam and telling you that hey you can ask help from me so yeah they will never fail you i have called on to a lot of my angels my guardian angel who never fails me you know i call on to him i've called on to him for so many times i have never been failed by my guardian angel yeah so yeah the overall outcome for this is the seven of cups i see you having a lot of options why because at first you weren't so sure about what you want i see this as options coming in ang gusto mo gusto mo magkaroon now let's just say if you're a girl or you know however you identify with yourself gusto ko magkaroon ng relationship gusto ko magkaroon ng relationship na good looking yung tao gusto ko magkaroon ng relationship na good looking mabait yung tao. Gusto ko magkar ay ayoko na pala. Gusto ko ng relationship na good looking, matalino and mabait yung tao. Alam mo yun? Gets mo yun? You tend to manifest a lot of people in your life because you aren't firm with what you want at first. So what you want to do is understand firmly what you want and what you don't want in a relationship. And and that number 1 card, that number 1 cup will come to you in the very form and everything exactly what you want in the relationship yeah so yes understand that i see you as an overall outcome i see you bear, uh, being very at your best at this time you are at your best but you are in a very defensive position and you know that very dis defensive position it requires to use a lot of strength so if i were you i would just be myself. I'd let my guard down. I just let, you know, I just let things come toward me. That's it for me. Eh? I mean, yeah. So, yeah, this is you being so guarded, so defensive, and that defensiveness is requiring a lot of strength from you. Nakapagod yun. Overall. Outcome, I overall advise. Overall advice. Overall advice is the Six of Cups, the Two of Swords, and the Nine of Wands. So, the Six of Cups, it just means that you... It's up to you naman kasi if you want to stay in that relationship. In the past, you want to go to that relationship from your past. You want to go back. It's up to you. But this card, the advice is just to keep the good memories with you. You know, sometimes there are so many things that you went through na parang feeling mo hindi mo na mababalikan yung relationship na yun. But know that there were good memories. Hindi mo pwedeng ipagkailan na there were good memories with the two of you. And those memories, you will just cherish. You just have, you can just look back. Hindi mo kailangan na balikan. Okay. Two of Swords. I see you deciding 
to you are no you are actually being in an energy where there is indecision why because hindi mo you can you can you are in an energy where you can't leave the old memories or the old person or the past person behind and i feel that it's making you very anxious so what you need to do is your mind over heart mind over heart when it comes to decisions so understand that there's someone better coming in if you decide to let go of this person someone better will come in i promise you i promise you that and lastly nine of wands you have to you don't have to be so guarded you don't have to be so defensive you don't have to put your walls up what you have to do is you have to heal you are a wounded warrior right now you are a wounded warrior and you have to heal from that situation for all these new things to come into your life you have to heal with from the situation that the situation that you came from the situation or the relationship that you came from you have to heal from it so yeah before all these good things and the, all the will allow all the wheel of fortune to come in and the new manifested love you have to heal from the old love from the old wounds that's coming into uh, that that you came from don't go into re to a relationship where you haven't healed from the last one because uulit lang yan uulit lang yung cycle na yan i promise you uulit yan okay the the oracle card to cap off your reading is chemistry there is a strong magnetic attraction here so whatever you are manifesting in there will be chemistry between the two of you that's nice okay so i will leave it here my dear pisces i hope something in this reading resonated if it did please like this video and please subscribe to my channel um everything all the readings on this uh, on this channel are free um it's completely free for everyone i hope you can also share my channel and videos to other people you think would be interested and would need my readings so thank you so much and thank you for watching and stay blessed thank you